<sighs> well, what's up, YouTube? It's been a while, but hell. <laughs> anyway, so, um, for anyone who follows Lady Crave Dancer here on YouTube, um, she made an oil recipe, um, a while back, I think like a few months ago, called Death Oil. Now, eh, I found a few things, I mean, it took me a while, I mean, start off. A bottle that was given to me by a friend when I was living in California. Yes, I mean, I get that it's blue, especially painted glass, but it has been cleansed already. I've cleansed it recently. And the blue, because this being death oil, um, helps with the healing process. Um, for me, um, I have graveyard dirt that a friend is letting me use for this. Um, for her, because of the specific way she made it for the usage, she used a lizard, which for me, reptilians, because they naturally shed their skin, um, transformation, rebirth, etc. For me, um, I was working a job with a now friend of mine, and while I was in the job, because I was helping paint the room to get the house ready for sale and everything, I found this moth. It was just there, minding its own business. I did ask the spirit of the moth to take it, and it was fine with it. For me, moths are a transformation because of going from one form to another, and because of them being basically the nighttime version of the butterfly. Um, it's also the the healing energies of the moon and lunar energies. So yeah. And of course, you know, I've had great success with it myself, but using red pepper or cayenne for a power boost. And of course, um olive oil for healing. Great for the skin, of course. <laughs> Now, here's a thing that I myself have remembered recently. Um, when Lady Grave Dancer did her love and passion oil all that time ago, um, I remember what she said about using matches if you don't have sulfur powder. So, recently I bought um, a box of green light matches, basically the big boxes you get of these. Got it at Walmart for like, not even three bucks. And because, you know, red being fire, power, etc. With me, I am connecting this more with the colors and properties of Earth. So, so that way it will help ground the, it'll help ground the energies to better empower the oil. So, yeah, I just thought I would share, you know, what I would be using in this death oil. So, thanks for watching, and I'm going to apologize now for, you know, any time I was silent or any kind of background noise. So, thanks, and <laughs> bless be.